hey y'all so again i couldn't let you go through a video without a little sponsorshipy ship so shout out to dossier for sponsoring your girl's video today you guys you know i love me some perfume honey a couple years ago i got the opportunity to work with an amazing company which is dossier and they pretty much create fragrances or scents Perfume, okay? We love to smell good, period, okay? So, I want to come to give you guys today a couple of their scents that I think you should definitely go out and take a look, see, and kind of like, you know, do a little purchase purchase. Anywho, so Dossier is pretty much a fair opportunity for cheaper luxury scents. We know everybody always goes out and talks about all these wonderful perfume, um, and they're luxury scents. They cost a pretty penny, but you guys, with Dossier, you can get popular fragrances for cheap. Like, who wouldn't? And you guys, they're actually great quality. They last all day on the skin and they smell absolutely wonderful. So I definitely would recommend that you guys check them out. They did send me over two of their wonderful scents. I got to pick out a new scent. So I did go for the Ambery Vanilla as well as the, don't, don't quote me, Gourmand patchouli. I think that's what it is. But anywho, you get to actually pair scents with Darcia so you can just purchase as many as you would like. You can pair them, you can wear them on their own, all this great stuff. So this one to me reminds me of black opium. I think this reminds me of that. It's very, very ambery, it's very vanilla. It's kind of, you know, powerful at the same time. And this patchouli scent, this one has like a lot of caramel, vanilla, cocoa. It has like a lot. And what I love about Dossier, they actually put like all the top, middle, and bottom notes on the bottle so that you can actually see what's in there. So even though if you're online and you're purchasing, you're kind of doing something like a blind buy, you still kind of know to what to expect when they get to your door. So let me go ahead and give me a little spray spray of this amber vanilla because she does smell wonderful. And yes, I did choose amber vanilla because my name was low key in it. <laughs> But it was a great choice because she smells wonderful. If you are interested in these scents, definitely go over to Dossier.com. I'll definitely leave the link in the description box below so that you can purchase your own. Check out the different kinds of scents that they have. You guys, they're at really affordable rates and I promise you'll find something there that you like. All right, y'all, that's it, that's all. Let's go and get back into the video. Hey, oh, hey, it's Friday. It's actually extremely late. It's 10.40, it's almost 11 o'clock. I'm so tired. <laughs> I just got back in from shopping, late night decor shopping. I, so I purchased quite a bit of stuff today. Um, I think one of my more exciting purchases that I made finally was a rug for the living room. This is the rug that I got you guys from Home Goods. It is massive. It's massive. And look at the detail of the rug. I love it. Love it, love it, love it, love it. Gorgeous. Um, the amount that I paid for it was $2.99. And this is the type of rug it is. Safavai? Don't, don't, don't give me the lion. Um, <laughs> but I was looking for a rug very similar to this online and i found one over at um rugs usa which is typically where i purchased all my rugs from um for my last house i purchased all my rugs from there but i decided to look around and see if i can score you know just any deals out that i could find the rug that i wanted that was similar to this it was mainly just like this made like this it was four hundred dollars for eight by ten and girl, I'm just not willing to pay $400 for a rug. I love it. Of course, when I get my couch, my couch is gonna go on this wall. And uh -oh. I'm just gonna get one couch. I'm not gonna do a sectional down here. I don't wanna do a sectional. We have a sectional upstairs, so there's no point. Don't mind that stuff over there. Um, But yeah. I'm very satisfied with my choice. I don't know if I showed you guys my thing for like the house. Yeah, my phone's broken. Don't worry, I purchased a new one. I'm all, it's in my purse. I just need to switch over all the information, but this is the look that I'm going for. As you can see, I got my mirror in there. 
If you look in the background, you see a rug very similar to the one that I have. I got those poofs. I got that table. That's the couch that I have. Well, I purchased, but it hadn't got to me yet. I got those paintings. Literally. All this stuff. Well, I get the picture lights. I forgot my picture lights. But uh, I got those chairs. I literally picked out everything, put it in a collage, and this is how I decorated the rooms of my house. I gotta still put my bookshelves together this weekend. I gotta clear all this stuff out of my office so I can get it set up because I be having work to do and I do not feel productive when I'm working anywhere else but like an office. So this is my desk. I put it together all by myself. <laughs> This is my desk, super cute. It's like the shiny white desk. Um, these chairs I've already had, I have two of them for my old place. Um, these are my bookshelves, so they're like the same color, the white and the like brass gold my bookshelves. This is my dresser that I'm gonna like store all of my makeup and all that stuff in, in my office. Also bought this mirror to go in my office when I'm doing videos for like trial hauls or whatever so I can see what I'm doing. And then this is my leopard print rug. Um, six by nine. My leopard print rug is so cute. What is that on my chairs? What is this? I said something on my chair. Yeah, we also got a housewarming gift. For my fairy godmother. <laughs> she got us a uh what you call it? A heat warmer. Um to go on the patio. Alright, you guys, just want to show you some of the items that I picked up from Target, Marshalls, and Home Goods last night. We're gonna start on this side, however. So I got all of these. Um this looks very much gray. It's probably black, but it's like see-through. But um, I got all of these. I got these set of bowls, I got these set of bowls. I got this large bowl, like for mixing and stuff. I got some taller cups, so I got some short cups. And then some taller cups. I got these plates. Can y'all see? Got these plates. I got this um, flatware set. I was gonna get the black, but I just feel like over time, the black is probably going to not be good for us. <laughs> Cause I'm a dishwasher. I'm gonna throw it in the dishwasher real quick, okay? And then I have this kitchen set with some uh, oven mitt pot holders and some um, towels. So these were all 75 cents a piece. I think Walmart has these too for like 50 cents, but I was in Target, so I went ahead and got it from Target, okay? Oh yeah, I, already, I got this drying mat too, um, just for stuff that I hand wash and put on top of the counter. But yeah, that's what that looks like. But yeah, all these were 75 cents a piece. And y'all, I was so mad because they only had the self-checkout open. So now I see how the cashiers and stuff feel when they be up there having to scan all this stuff. <laughs> I, and I was like, eh, beep, beep, beep. But anyway, so yeah, I got eight of those, eight of these bowls, that one bowl, eight of these cups, eight of these cups, eight of these plates. So that's gonna be our dinner, wear, dishware, whatever. For the stuff that I got from Marshalls and stuff. There are a couple of things that I'm going to take back because I found better versions. So I found this one in Target. This is like an oil thing, so I can put my olive oil in there. But I like this because it didn't have a top and I can just, you know, toss it over. And this is a really good stopper. It's not like falling out. And it was only like $4. Um, so I got that from Target, but I had already gone into Hunger's and Marshalls and found this one. Thing I don't like about this is the stopper is weak, so I feel like over time that stopper is gonna come out and then I have to take this off. And who wants to do that? So <laughs> it was only about, how much was this? It was only $4 as well, but I'm not gonna use it, so I'm gonna take it back. And then I also purchased this little cutting board that I can, it's like just for decor. But I'm gonna take it back because I found a better one at Target. That was only $7.99. The one I found at Target was like $25, but I like the one at Target better. I also got this from Target, this threshold um, wall decor. I bought it specifically to go 
right there on that wall so that when you come in from the door, you're not just looking at wall. So <laughs> I think I'm gonna get something similar to this to go right here in the kitchen so that that wall isn't so blank as well. But I figured those three, these three, you know, frames, they're like that, but I'm gonna line them up, are gonna look really, really nice on that wall right there. Um, this is, somebody put the paper towel on for me. <laughs> this is a paper towel holder, $7.99. I got this from Marshalls. Um, that little part is black and this is brown. I figured it goes good with like the little aesthetic or the theme that I'm looking for or going for. I got these little stands. They're $5 at Target. So I was like, why not get them? I'm pretty sure I'm gonna find some kind of use for them. This was $11.99. I got this from, is it? I think I got this from Target. Yeah, because Target's the one that be having the okay. most fixed products. I can't think. I can't. Mm, did I get it from Target? No, I got it from Hobby Lobby. I lied real quick. What? That was from Hobby Lobby. This was from Home Goods. It was $19.99. Home Goods, Marshall, the same thing. It doesn't say Home Goods. Uh, um, $19 bucks for that. I felt like it was really cute. Uh, this is a spoon rest. I got this from Hobby Lobby. It was 40% off of $7.99, so why wouldn't I? <laughs> I got these two little stands it's for decor to put stuff on. This one's from Hobby Lobby, 40% off of $29.99. I can't say it. And then this one, ooh, had I saw that, I probably wouldn't pick this one up. But <laughs> this one was $29.99, 40% off of Hobby Lobby. I got these little trays. Probably to put like jewelry or something in. I don't know quite, not quite sure yet. Um, but they're five dollars a piece from Target. So I'm pretty sure my husband will like plug his watches and stuff like that in there. That'll be beneficial for him. My idea for this was to go onto the entryway table once it gets in. I think I should get it Sunday to put like our mail in. So that way when we're walking right in the house, entryway table, put our mail there. Whatever. <laughs> and then I got this cutting board from Target. I figured it'll go good. I feel like this will go good with this super long cutting board that I got from uh, from Hobby Lobby a while back. And I got this base from Home Goods. It was $24.99. Super cute. Can't wait to style all this stuff. And then this, uh, I got a set of Three, three kits, I got three different kits. Three uh, kits are nine. Ooh. Each of the kits have three frames in them, so it's a total of nine frames. And that's gonna go in our dining room on this wall. I think I told y'all this last night, I can't remember. But y'all, these were 40% off, 39 dollars at Hobby Lobby too. So, I got these a while back when I got the cutting board, but this is everything I purchased at the store so far. Everything else I'm waiting on from Amazon. To get here. I'm Good morning, you guys. Today, um, it's Valentine's Day. Happy Valentine's Day to everybody. Um, so, I just figured out that I need to order another bed for my my, my oldest daughter. Apparently, her order was canceled um, because Walmart could not fulfill it. So, I need to be searching for a new gold bed frame for her. And I'm going to put up all my books up. I'm going to get my office set up today. Period. Okay. Um, babe talking about doing lunch. And I low-key don't know. <laughs> because I seriously want to get all this stuff done in the house. I'm tired and I haven't done. I've got an off day. Don't ever get an off day. I forgot I had taken off for Valentine's Day. At the beginning of the year for like annual time and stuff. So, hey. I'm here. I'm going to go ahead and get this stuff done. So, I don't have to do it for the rest of the week. And I can be productive in my office. Oh, my office. <laughs> And I can be productive in my office doing work. Yeah, right now I'm looking, about to look for a bed. And then I think around 9, if I don't find one by 9.15, I'll just chunk this and look for it tomorrow. Because I want to get started on um, building these bookcases and stuff. So I guess that's what I'm going to look for. Um, I did buy a lot of stuff yesterday. We went grocery shopping last night. So the fridge is full for the, ver the very first time. But my kitchen's a hot mess. <laughs> So we have food, y'all. There is food in the refrigerator. Look at God. Mm, mm, mm. 
so many light switches in this house. I was like, my God, it's just crazy. So I got this non-stick ceramic cookware set from my local Sam's Club. And I already know that y'all know exactly what it looks like, which is exactly why I bought it. Hopefully it's the same. <laughs> this looks like the Caraway um, set, but I think it comes with more pieces here. And so, y'all, when I tell you this set is gorgeous, it's absolutely gorgeous. It's like a hundred and something dollars. Y'all know the Caraway set is like three hundred, four hundred dollars. So yeah, it says it has a non-stick ceramic, um, I'm sorry, the non-toxic ceramic non-stick coated interior, induction compatible, dual um, riveted cast stain with steel handles, dishwasher safe, oven safe, all that good stuff. So hopefully I like this, okay? But yeah, I was really excited to tell y'all about that. All right, you guys, we have made so much progress. I am so excited. So we've gotten my dresser putting together this particular drawer looks a little wonky i might have to put that one at the bottom you know what i'm saying mm -hmm. however i got my dresser done oh, i'm so excited so this dresser um my desk i got this bookshelf done and that bookshelf don't mind all the boxes we had an amazon delivery let's just say i went crazy on amazon okay um and then of course still got boxes over there uh i got my mirror over there i am so happy so don't mind a mess i just got back to the house and finished this um what we did was these were the knobs that came for the dresser but if you can tell like this is like a rose it's like a rose gold it's not like Y'all probably can't tell on camera, but it's definitely giving rose gold. But compared to these, I feel like this color matched everything else a little bit better than these. So um, I went, these are the ones that came with it. I went to Hobby Lobby and got these. They're $6 a piece. So I just ended up getting um, six of these for the drawers. This one still ain't acting right. Oh, well, it'll be all right. But, um... Yeah, so I got these instead. They look so much better. I'm so excited. I just can't hide it. It's coming along. And I also purchased these formats or rugs or whatever you want to call them for outside. So on one side it says goodbye. The other side it says hello. I think I got that one right here from Target and I got this one from Amazon. But it's so cute. I can't wait to decorate the porch area. I probably want to get some of those like little lantern canister things and put them on both sides or on maybe on one side and then get like a little wooden welcome sign. I really want one of those. And then I want to do some chairs out here, chairs and a table to go in the middle. I saw some really good ones at um, Home Goods, so I may go back and get those, but we'll see but for now let me get this junk up out of here y'all please excuse all this junk for real because <laughs> it looks bad but <laughs> it's all comes with the process of taking things out putting together but let me get in here and get started on oh, I know. get started on this room a lot of the stuff is in that room um probably doesn't belong in there Oh, my husband took the pots out the box, y'all. They are so heavy. When I say so heavy, I'm not exaggerating. They are heavy. Child, the lids are heavy. Everything heavy. Super heavy. Okay. y'all so this is what i've done so far a lot of the stuff oh, excuse me, I've been a lot of the stuff went into the closet um some stuff was actually good enough for trash <laughs> um so now that i got the majority of everything cleaned out this is pretty much what's going to stay in here that's things that actually need to go out the drawers and stuff so i'm about to bring the carpet in the rug in 
and then um, I guess start building from there. Not building, but putting things together or piecing things together from there. down it needs to rest for a while so it can um, straighten out and everything but rug is there got my desk right here for now my chair I'm gonna put this other chair probably um over there or something and then my mirror I'm about to bring my mirror in here too it's gonna go in that corner this is about to be real cute and then I got um my paintings, they'll go up a little higher, of course, probably up there to where the bookshelves are or in the middle of that space. I would really want to get a sign up here. This is Amber Charnese. I have one, but it's like glitter gold. And I don't know how I feel about having glitter gold in here. I feel like it's going to, is a demature word? <laughs> Like it's gonna take the mature value out of the room if I were to do that. So I don't know. This room looks so big now <laughs> with this stuff in here. Like yes, all that clutter made it look so small. But yeah, let me move these boxes out of the way so I can get my mirror in here. That's it, y'all. So I'll check back later on.